where Chris Gabe and this is GC Extreme channel. Today we're gonna make Jello M5. Yeah, and we call it GC Extreme Jello. So today we're making M5 pre-workout jello. It's gonna taste amazing. And we're gonna take a, take you through the process. Okay? So step number one, you need to get some jello pack. They come in a variety of flavors. Yeah, he has what flavor do you have? I have raspberry. I have strawberry bananas. Great flavor. Okay? You can get them at Walmart, Publix, any local store. They're really cheap. Just 10 calories. Four serving sizes. Taste great. Okay, so this is one of our main ingredients. Of course, the second main ingredient is gonna be your pre-workout. M5 Extreme is what we're using today. So we're gonna try it. It's the first time we do this. We'll see how it goes. So I guess you can use any workout, pre-workout or supplement you want, as long as it's in powder form. So, okay, we're gonna start. First of all, you need to boil some water. So I'm gonna start boiling some water over there. In the meantime, you have to get a measuring tool device. Basically, a cup, you know, because we're gonna be measuring one boiling cup of water and one cold cup of water. Then, the second thing we need is a bowl. A bowl. Make sure it's like big enough to handle at least two cups of water. You don't want to spill any of your nice pre water right? You don't want to waste any. Whoa! Kettle's boiled. Great. So we're gonna start. This is yours. Right? This is my one. Okay. Watch out, it's gonna be really hot. Okay, watch Kate measure the cup. Okay, so here we go. No help. One, That's one cup. cup. So please. pour it into the bowl. Okay, now that's for my bowl. Let's you do yours. Another one cup. cup of boiling water. Great, now we need to get oh, a spoon, something to stir this up. Jello. A little packet. Quite tasty. Well, this little spoon may work. And now the fun part, open package. You can see the jello comes in crystal form. Pretty standard jello. Okay, so pour it in. Here we go. You can borrow your spoon and just stir the jello. How's your doing? It looks good. Nice and... Alright, let's just give it a couple yep. ten more seconds. Yep. Be thorough. Like Why our not? workouts. Why not? Now, could you get uh, from the fridge? Now we're gonna get some cold water. A cup of cold water. And we're gonna mix it and pour it inside the bowl. Just look how cold this thing looks. Cold water. A little more. That's good enough. Okay. Thank you, Gabe. Just, mm. just go ahead. A little more. There we go. So we pour it on the ball. Let's get a quick stir. And now the foam part. <laughs> We're going to start off with the pre-workout nice scoops. Yep. Take two of these little scoops. They look little, but they're pretty powerful. They are powerful. One. scoop of the deal product, which is a creatine. Now, this is, uh, what is it? Uh, I think it's punch flavor. 
So when doing your jelly, try to match the flavor of your pre-workout with the actual flavor of the jelly. That way it's not going to taste so weird, I guess. Okay. And now we stir it up again until everything is dissolved. This might take a little while. Just watch out not to drop anything out of the bowl. You want to keep all your pre-workout goodness in there. When you're sure everything's dissolved, pop it in the fridge for three to four hours. Four hours. Four hours. Or until it is nice and solid. Okay, looks pretty much dissolved. Looks good. So here's the final, well not the final product, but the pre-final product we can call it. And now, we're just gonna grab this. Put it in the fridge. And take it to the fridge. Now we have my stuff in the fridge. I'm not taking yours, so you can grab yours. <laughs> We're gonna put it. Uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> ah, there. Okay, so that's it, guys, for today. Mm -hmm. That was how we prepared our Jello GC Extreme. See you tomorrow. tomorrow. We're gonna take it. We're gonna and tomorrow we'll take you through, you know, and we'll tell you how it goes, how we feel it, how it tastes. So we'll see you tomorrow, guys.